be thou glorified. There is none like you. None can be compared to you. You are the Lord and the Master. You are the beginning and the end. You are the great physician, the one who is the Redeemer of the world, the Savior of the world, the one who heals by his wounds. Masa Karaba Sundaraba, the head that wear at the thorns of the crown of thorns. Marebo Sundaraba, the side that bleeds, the side that bleeds for water and blood. Jesus Emmanuel, our Savior, our Redeemer. Masa Karebo Sundaraba, the divine. to show us mercy. You are here. If you are mindful of our sins, if you are mindful of our shortcomings, who shall stand before you? Therefore we approach your throne, your throne of mercy. You are mercy himself. Mare pose keri babara kasundara mari prokotori kasundara ba. Let the water and blood that flow from your side cleanse us from every unrighteousness, whatever that may be. We submit ourselves to you for cleansing. Mare makuri makundara mari prokotori kasekere bo sundara ba. Masuri makere bo kendara bara kasekere bo sundara ba. Riprokotori ba. judgment. Let your mercy prevail over judgment. Let your mercy prevail over judgment in our lives. In the mighty name of Jesus. We invite you, the Holy Spirit, we thank you for being in our midst. We invite you, Archangel Michael, Archangel Ural, Archangel Raphael, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Chapuel, we invite you, Saint Antoninus. We invite you, Blessed Iwenetansi, my father and my brother. We invite you, Saint Anthony of Padua. We invite you, Blessed Kalu Akudis. We invite you, Saint Anne. We invite you, Our Lady of Valley. We invite you, Our Lady of Sorrow. before the Almighty God through your powerful intercession in the mighty name of Jesus. Yeah. We forbid every spirit of destruction to operate in this place. For the word of God says in Matthew 18, whatever you bind here is bound in heaven. Whatever you release here is released in heaven. In one accord we ask that this environment be set ablaze. That every demon, every spirit that is not of God be expelled by this fire. Let the fire from the Eucharistic altar arise. 
you from that demon and we command the demon to be expelled from you now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Holy Rosary. Come Holy Spirit and fill the hearts of the faithful. Send forth your spirit and thou shalt be created. Let us pray. O God, whose only begotten Son, by his life, 
O God, who's only, O God, who's our light of the Holy Spirit, lead and stroke the hearts of the faithful, warn us in the sense of and be truly wise, and ever rejoice in this consolation through Christ our Lord. Amen. And our Lord shall open our lips. Incline unto our aid, O Lord. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Our Father, I believe in God, the Father Almighty, creator of heaven and earth, and in Jesus Christ, his only Son, our Lord, who was conceived by the Holy Spirit, born of the Virgin Mary, suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended into hell. The third day he rose again from the dead. He ascended into heaven and sits at the right hand of God, the Father Almighty. From thence he shall come to judge the living and the dead. Forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the Father, and life everlasting. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. O oh my Jesus. The five sorrowful mysteries. The first, the agony in the garden. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed are thou amongst women, 
and bless the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. Oh my Jesus. Jesus, have mercy on us. May the souls of the faithful departed. The second sorrowful mystery, the, the scourging of Pierre. Notre Père qui es aux cieux, que ton nom soit sanctifié, que ton règne vienne, que ta volonté soit faite sur la terre comme au ciel. Lord, this day we are delivered, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes. Et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes. Et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners. Now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes. Et Jésus, Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes. Et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes. Et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes. Et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes. Et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. In the beginning is now and ever shall be, all without end. Amen.
the crown in return to June. Let me pay a clear to see you, but only on Swiss and Tiki. But only in the year in Peter Bonotti, so I pay still a pair of the seal. He bought this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Je vous salue, Marie, pleine de grâce. Le Seigneur est avec vous. Vous êtes bénie entre toutes les femmes, et Jésus, le fruit de vos entrailles, est béni. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Gloire soit au Père, au Fils et au Saint-Esprit. As it was in the beginning, it's now and ever shall be. Oh my Jesus. Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell. Lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of thy mercy. The fourth sorrowful mystery, the carrying of the cross. Elizabeth. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Ekenemi Maria, Gracia Jubi, Zimeni Noyali, Imen Gozikali Uhunini, Gozdeli Wan Foibu Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ekenemi Maria, Gracia Jubi, Zimeni Noyali, Imen Gozikali Uhunini, Gozdeli Wan Foibu Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ekenemi Maria, Gracia Jubi, Zimeni Noyali, Iwen Gozikali Uhunini, Gozdeli Wan Foibu Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ekenemi Maria, Gracia Jubi, Zimeni Noyali, Iwen Gozikali Uhunini, Gozdeli Wan Foibu Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ekenemi Maria, 
Gracia Jobi, you win in Noyani, you win God the Kali Ohoni, and God the Dilima for Ibu Jesu. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ekenemi Maria, Gracia Jobi, you win in Noyani, you win God the Kali Ohoni, and God the Dilima for Ibu Jesu. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Ekenemi Maria, Gracia Jovi, Timoni Noyali, you went God the Kali Ohuni, God the Dilima for Ibu Jesu. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ekenemi Maria, Gracia Jovi, Timoni Noyali, you went God the Kali Ohuni, God the Dilima for Ibu Jesu. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ekenemi Maria, Gracia Jobi, Timoni Noyali, you win God the Kali Ohoni, God the Dilima for Ibu Jesu. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ekenemi Maria, Gracia Jobi, Timoni Noyali, you win God the Kali Ohoni, God the Dilima for Ibu Jesu. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. As it was in the beginning, it's now and ever shall be, all without end. Amen. O oh my Jesus, forgive our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of thy mercy. The fifth sorrowful mystery, the um, crucifixion. Pater Noster, quia in chelis, sanctifice tu nomen tu, adveniat regnum tu, fiat voluntas tua, sicut in cielo et in terra. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, Benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum. Benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tui, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tui, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, Benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum. Benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, et benedictus fructus ventris tu, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, Pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Ave Maria, gratia plena, Dominus tecum, benedicta tu in mulieribus, 
et benedictus fructus ventris tui, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Gloria Patri, et Filio, et Spiritui Santo. As it was in the beginning, it's now, and it never shall be, all without end. Amen. Oh, my Jesus. Forgive us our sins, save us from the fires of hell, lead all souls to heaven, especially those who are in most need of thy mercy. Salve Regina, Mater Misericordiae, Vita Dulcedo, Espres Nostra Salve, A Te Brothers and sisters, our blessed mother is here in a special way with us. Coming in, she came in wearing a flowing gown. We're going to appeal to her intercession that the same thing that happened in Fatima will happen in our midst. As this song go on, I need you to lift up yourself, your family, and your situation. Oh, come to the throne of grace.
We honor you, our own mother. Help us. Pray for us. That your, the name of your son, Jesus Christ, is glorified in our lives, in our situations. As you did and performed many miracles in Fatima, we implore you, O oh Mother of God, we implore you. The divine adorers implore you. We implore your intercession. Intercede for every family represented here. For every family represented in divine adoration. Intercede for St. Antoninus. That the power of God reign in this parish. That Jesus, your son, is glorified in this parish. Thank you for being with us. Amen.
Amen. The best thing in life is to follow instruction of the master. He took over and it became an unusual gathering of the people of God. So if you are here, just wave unto him and say, thank you that I'm here today. Amen. Some of us have not really experienced what it means to worship for over 30 minutes. Now you've done it for probably an hour 30 minutes. Amen. That's who we are. We adore Jesus in the Eucharist. That's what we do. We are divine adorers. Amen. So we have little time. We're not going to give talk as, the, as per the Lord's instruction. That's what you see. I know some of us already are worshiping up until now. When are we going to leave? By the time they give the talk, well, we're not giving talk. Amen. So relax, relax. Praise God. So what we're going to do is that we will listen to testimonies. And after the testimonies, we'll pray for those who came um, for the first time. And after that, then we'll round up. We go into prayers. Oh, okay. Amen. <laughs> Interesting. Thank you, Jesus. You are really making us real adorers. Okay. Amen. Yeah, that's it's always wonderful. So for those of you who don't go to Eucharistic adoration, this is what you miss. So beginning today, learn to go at least an hour a week. If you can do more, excellent. Praise God. So how many people want to give testimony? Please make it quick if you have testimony. Okay, one, two, any other person? Three. Oh, okay, so I'm the fourth person, but I'm going to be the first because I'm holding the mic. <laughs> Praise God. So my testimony is actually on behalf of um, our adorers and to show us that our prayers work. Our prayer work. I say it all the time. Our prayer work. Our prayers work. Amen. And I say it emphatically because I know if you have not read 1 John chapter 5, verses 14 to 14 to 15, please, when you go home, read it and stand on it. These are one of the Bible verses given to the, this group. And that's why you hear me say our prayer works. 1 John chapter 5, verses 14 to 15. Amen. Amen. So um, we have been praying for um, fruit of the womb for different persons, um, believing God for that. And so we have two of our sisters. You know, for the past four days before Thursday, I noticed that we are calling me like starting from month, maybe Tuesday or so busy. Like, and when I would try to call back, they, they would also be busy. But it turned out that after prayer on Thursday, I decided to, I saw missed calls from them again. So I called one of them and she said, oh, Sister Kiro, God has answered us. She's pregnant. Amen. <laughs> after many years, I don't know the exact years, but I know it's way above, I know it's above five to seven years that she has been believing God for that. So praise the Lord. Was talking to her, another call was coming in. So I sent the person the one it says as I'm gonna call you back. So when I was done with rejoicing and all that, I called the second person back and she said, Oh my god, God has done it. Ooh, amen. And she said, I am pregnant. I standing in prayers for them. I've been standing in prayers for them. It is not me. It is us. You see, what people don't know is that 
And I can tell you based because I kind of know a little bit of what's going on with those people. There are some situations you are experiencing as powerful as you are because it was a community of demons or witches or spirits that came together to establish what is happening in your life. It will take a community of believers to break it. So stop deceiving yourself, I can pray alone. That is satanic agenda to destroy you. Most of the things projected to you are not done by one spirit. So as powerful as your personal prayer may be, if what is affecting you is as a result of evil projection from community of Satan, demons, it's gonna take community of believers to undo that. And that is why when we gather, it is so powerful there are gifts of God that would manifest in our midst that will never manifest in your personal prayer. Why? And that's why God said, do not ignore the gathering of believers, the gathering of the children of God. There is power when she's praying and praying. You're praying and praying. And we are looking at one altar. We are operating from one altar. Then we are raising that altar to fight altar. Because we don't get this. We just think, you know, I could just say my rosary and all that. Even our blessed mother Mary, who is here in her midst. I don't know how many of you saw it, but I saw her just grace, gracefully walking in. And that was so, so awesome. And uh, lastly, before we start the testimonies, you see the privilege we have. I, I, and when I say it, I kind of say it, and some people don't even take it seriously. We have, we pray before the Eucharistic Jesus. It's powerful. I don't, I don't stress myself. Why would I stress myself when the Lord himself is here? When you don't pray where he's exposed, let me tell you the difference. It's going to take you a while to call down his presence. In our case, he's here. That's why I don't stress. He's here. So if you have the father, the governor, is right in front of you. Come on now. Do you need to go and look for the assistance to ask for anything? The master is here. The Lord is here. And so sometimes people will say, we have, let's do this, let's do that. We're not doing on any of those. Because he's here. And sometimes I tell him, you see all those people, they come for you, including myself. Their presence here has nothing to do with me. Answer your people. And that's the why I pray, because he is here. Amen. So I want to encourage us with this testimony. Oh, there's another last one. Um, the last one was um, one of us, I mean, she comes in from Connecticut once in a while. Um, to this place. And so one of us had called me, when was that? I, I can't remember, but she reached out to me and said, the son Sebastian had an accident. And she said, she, I don't know how bad it is. And so on Thursday we prayed. And so the mom called me this morning to say he's out of hospital and he's recovering. Our prayer works. Amen. So I'm going to give the, who is the second person? Yes, brother. <laughs> Praise God. I have a father. He will never, never fail me. I have a father. He will never, never fail me. Jesus is my father. He will never, never fail me. Rock of ages, never, never, never fail. I have a father. He will never, 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 never fail. I have a father. He will never, never fail me. Jesus is my father. He will never.
Praise the Lord. Amen. 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 I had wanted to give this testimony in the conference. But when Sister said those who wanted to give, to, I found myself raising my hand. Up. I said, okay, let me just give it. <laughs> Amen. Amen. Yes, our prayer works. Our prayer works. By the way, me being here is a testimony. You will not understand. <laughs> it's another day. <laughs> Amen. <laughs> Praise God. For some of you who don't know, there's been a thorn in my flesh for the past 28 years. You know, Paul, Paul talks about this thorn when he says the messenger of Satan was sent to torment him. Three times he prayed to the Lord and the Lord said, my grace is sufficient. For 28 years, over 28 years, I have suffered insomnia. Night after night, week after week, Month after month. It is sleepless night. You lay on your bed and sleep doesn't come. And then during the day, the sleep doesn't come. Yes. It is now that it's coming out that you know. So when sister is saying pray for, for her, pray. Because there are many things that don't come out until a day like this. When somebody asks for your prayer, just pray for them. So when this thing started, I way, way, way back in my high school, I had thought this is just maybe one of those things. As time went on, I got to a point where I said, maybe this is the will of God. But as you journey in faith, when I met my sister, when she came to St. Anthony, I remember mentioning it to her. She started praying about it. She began to pray for me. And I had other priests and friends who also know that I passed through this. You know, for many days, I remember nights where I felt like, what is the essence of life then? There were times I feel like I'm having, I'm about to have a heart attack. For you to go weeks, night after night, no sleep. And I was still very active during the day. So to God be the glory, so a few years ago, this, my sister here told me, she now referred me back. She said, this thing happened around when you were 18 years old. And this was what was done. And I began to retrace my step back. And I said, I came to that point, it was at my 18th year. You see, we do not wrestle against flesh and blood. There are many things that happen behind the scene. There are many things we suffer. We think, oh, it's the will of God. And that was my disposition for some time. I said, well, Lord, this is your will. If they, it looks like this is your will. You're not taking it away from me. And until as things started progressing, I remember one night, I was tired. That's when I knew, actually, this is not with the will of God. I had rest two, three the weeks, not being able to sleep. I would go from one room to another. I would go to my living room. I would go to the guest room, just trying to see which one would be comfortable. And it became so bad, like, sometimes I feel like I'm about to have a heart attack. And there was a night, I remember that night, the devil is alive. I had just come to my living room, I'm struggling to sleep. And it's as if there was, the sleep was about to happen. And then a demon came and laughed at me. No, I'm, I'm before the Lord. A demon laughed. It was a laugh of you think you will sleep. I said, what? I said, okay. I prayed. I keep, you know, some more time I will pray. I will go to work sometime. I'm like a, a living ghost just walking around. Painful. But I'm not going to get into so much details of what has happened because the story has changed. The story has changed. Brothers and sisters, this is now three months. I have not used any medication and I've been sleeping. The yoke is broken. The yoke is broken. The yoke is broken. Your prayers worked. All of you that prayed for me. Thank you, Jesus. There is nothing that God cannot do. There is nothing my Lord Jesus cannot do. There is nothing my Lord Jesus cannot do. There is nothing my Lord Jesus cannot do.
nation before him. Tell him because you have witnessed this testimony that you are not far from the testimony because testimony is going to be part of your life. After today, by the power of God who is great and mighty, that which you seek from the Lord will receive divine intervention. In the name of Jesus, we witness the testimony of the bondage breaking and the testimony of the yoke being lifted. I decree upon your life that every yoke, every satanic yoke upon your life, the one you know and the one you don't know, by the reason of the word of God, in Isaiah 10, 27, let that yoke be lifted up now. Let that yoke and burden be lifted up now. Let the yoke be destroyed in the name of Jesus. Whether you're a Christian or not, you must go through it at one time. You would remember that this God is real. That what He says He will do, He will do. We thank God for the presence of our mother. Like I said, I saw her in a flowing gown. And she walked in to be with you and I. We are privileged in this prayer group. I'm telling you, we are privileged. In this prayer group. Amen? Amen. Who is the fourth person? I thought there was a fourth person. Oh, yeah.
actually, I have, <clears throat> I have two of them to tell you about. They're basically the, the same situation. Um, it was in October. My husband and I had gone away. We went on a cruise. And we were coming back. We came through customs. Everything was fine. Um, picked up our luggage. Went to take a cab. Went to my niece's house in Queens to pick up my car. And whilst putting the luggage away, I realized that I'm missing my bag. My, um, it was a pulley that I usually have, so I was missing that. It had my money, it had my, our passports, everything was in there. And all I kept saying was, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. I just kept repeating his name over and over and over again. So that means it took us 30 minutes to get from JFK to where my niece lives. And it's gonna take us another 30 minutes to go back to the airport. So I went back, went to the desk, and um, I asked if anybody had given anything in. They said no. So I stood up by the door that you came out of um, cut, um, the, right, um, where the, the luggage is. And there was a gentleman coming out. And I said, excuse me, sir, but I lost my bag. So he says, well, go to, you know, to the claims place to make in a report. So I said, no, it would be inside. Because I remember where I left it. I left it by the carousel. So he says, okay, let me go see if I find it. So when he was walking away, I said, so, but I have to tell you what my bag looks like. So I described the bag. I told him it has a, there was a, a blue, um, a pink Starbucks cup that I had on the side. And I told him what it was. And I just left everything. Then I saw him coming about 10 minutes later and he was pulling my bag behind him. <laughs> everything was in that bag. It was the same place I left it, and I got it. So, fast forward, fast forward. Last week, Thursday, was it the week before, my husband and I went to Florida. We went to, visit, you know, he wanted to get away for a few days, so we decided to go to Florida. Got to, Flor got to the Florida airport, went to pick up a car, I couldn't find that, I didn't like the cars that I was getting. I wanted something with GPS in it. Something that I could have, um, you know, navigate with the screen. So, my husband was getting a little upset with me because I sat down with about five cars. And he's like, make up your mind already. So I'm like, okay, I jumped into one. We were going, just when we were about to leave, I realized that the USB port was not working properly. So I said, I can't take this car with me. I have to go back. Went back, drove off the car, picked up another one, transferred our luggage, and we left. Went to the hotel. Must have been about, it was about a 30 to 35 minute ride. Got to the hotel, looking for my bag. <laughs> I don't have my bag. I have my wallet because I took my wallet out because I needed my driver's license for me to get out of the lot so that they can scan my license for me to leave with the car. At this point, all I kept saying again was Jesus, 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 Jesus. I just kept repeating Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. So my husband said, okay, what do you want to do? I said, let's go and check in because it was already late. Check in is at three. We got there, must have been about minutes to eight. So I said, okay, let's just go check in. So we checked in and we drove back to the airport. Took us 35 minutes, four minutes to get to the airport. And I got to the park, put, went back and I said to the guy, I left my pocketbook in one of the cars that I was supposed to drive away with. So he says, okay, just go quickly and look for it. So we went back to where I thought, where I parked the car. The car was not there. So my husband, that's what I thought, somebody had taken the car. So my husband, I went and I said, okay, did anybody return, you know, a, a pocketbook? They said, they said no. So my husband said, 
I'm going to go look for the car. Somebody moved that car from where we put it, brought it to another side, and my pocketbook was still in the back of that car. <laughs> Everything was in it. It was as if whoever moved the car never saw that pocketbook. So I found my pocketbook with, my pa with our passports, everything in it. So I have to say thank you, Jesus. <laughs> Praise the Lord. Ah, we thank God for this testimony. We thank God. So now we know what to say when you lose something. Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. Amen. Praise God. So we're going to invite those who are coming for the first time. Praise the Lord. Amen. Praise the Master Jesus. Amen. Praise the owner. Amen. Praise the King. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. I don't know what to say. I am full of miracles. I can't even say all. But let me just say the one that happened before I got here. I, I wanted to just sit back there and listen. And uh, Brother Francis. I didn't know if I raised my hand, but Brother Francis said, Sister has a, has a message, has a testimony. I'm like, wait a minute, did I raise my hand? And so I think, okay, he got the message. I actually was with a group of people, and my spirit said, you need to leave. And then let me just round up, you need to leave. I don't know, okay, I just said, you know what, I have to go. I have to be in prayer now, it's okay. I left and I got here, came in here. The it was the fire on the mountain, and I joined. So when Sister Kiru came up and said there was the spirit said, No talk today, it's adoration. I said, Yes, that's the reason I'm here. Because he said, Go. The Lord came for a visit, and this and you said Mother Mary came. Okay, so I got the message and I had to run because there is something that came in today. Go with it. Go with it. I didn't come. I'm not good at my, I try to keep quiet, but there is a reason for today. Key into today. Go with it. And people say they want more adoration, right? More worship. We need that. There is a reason for that. God bless you. Amen and amen. Our God is good all the time. Praise God. So we're going to pray over those who gave testimonies. Raise your hand to the Lord and let him rain his blessings upon them for the courage to testify, to bring glory to his name. Lord, we thank you for all the testifiers. We thank you for the miracles you have done in our midst. Your word in Psalm 77 verse 15 says, I am the God that performed miracle in the midst of my people. We are recipients of that miracle and we are grateful. We bring before your throne, before your throne of mercy, those who have testified. Lord, you are the God of A and Amen. As you have done it in their lives, your word in Matthew 18, from 18, from verse 18 to 20, say so whatever we agree here on earth is agreed in heaven. So we agree that this testimony that glorifies your name is permanent in their lives. In the name of Jesus, we cover the testimonies in the blood of Jesus. And because prophecy for one is prophecy for all, we all tap into these testimonies that we will come back with a baggage a bad field up with testimonies in the name of Jesus. May this you have begun to do in our lives continue in Jesus' name. We commit all the pregnant women into your holy hands. Father, that your name continue to be glorified in their lives. Protect them and their babies by the power of your name. We also connect those who seek the fruit of the womb. That through the testimonies and miracles of those you have blessed, they will receive their own Lord in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. So we are going to call out those who are coming for the first time. If today I'm seeing some new faces. 
If today is the first time you're coming, please step forward so we pray for you. New shining faces. Amen. to pray for this family. Thank God for their lives. It is not a coincidence that they are here. God ordered the steps here for his blessing for a purpose. Ask God that the purpose of bringing them in his presence be fulfilled in the name of Jesus. Father, we thank you, Lord, for this family. We bless your holy name and we commit them into your holy hands, O Lord, that you continue to bind them together in your love, O Lord, in unity and oneness of heart, in the name of Jesus. Lord, as they have witnessed, O Lord, the testimonies that you have, the miracles you have performed in our midst, O God, may their lives be filled with miracles in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Amen. Praise God. So let us pray for God's grace and God's favor upon them. Also pray for the lady because she is pregnant. Ask God to go ahead of her for, her, for his presence to be upon her unto delivery. In the name of Jesus, Father, we ask you for your grace upon them, for your favor upon them, Lord. Father, let them be favored before you and before men. In the name of Jesus. Father, surround them with walls of fire and make them untouchable to the evil one. In Jesus' mighty name we have prayed. Amen. You may now be seated. Oh, yeah, they want to know your name. Friends in the Holy Spirit Prayer Group, St. Patrick Catholic Church, Woolwich, London. Amen and amen. Thank you, sir. You are welcome in Jesus' name. So it's like being at home for him. We are one in the Lord. Amen. You are welcome in Jesus' name. Praise God. So we are about rounding up now. Um, we're going to stand up and as we worship and glorify God, we're going to just do one prayer point and that prayer point is for this prayer group. For this prayer group. One worship, one song of worship and then we'll hold our hands and now pray.
to step forward. I'm sorry, sister, but just come forward again. We're going to agree that by the power of God that is present in our midst, that every sickness upon her vanish now. Every sickness of the tummy, every pain, our prayer works. Our prayer is powerful. Open your mouth and decree over her. situation you're going through, just raise up your hand. You're not raising it to anybody. You're raising it to the Lord. The one who you raise your hand to. We, if you're holding somebody and you want to raise your hand, you know, feel free to just disengage for this minute. You're raising your hand up to the Lord. In our situation. Lord, may you show forth in the situations of your people. May you show forth in the lives of your people that whatever that situation is, oh Lord, let there be divine intervention in the name of Jesus. Let there be victorious intervention in the name of Jesus. Let there be miraculous intervention in the name of Jesus. prayer group and 
just ask for one thing, that his kingdom come and that his will be done in and through this prayer group. Open your mouth and pray. Father, let your kingdom come. Let your kingdom come. Let your kingdom come. Let your will be done, O oh Lord. Let your will be done, O oh Lord. Let your will be done, O oh Lord. With and through this prayer group. In the name of Jesus. Masorobo sekerebo. Riprokoto ribabaraka sundaraba. Masekerebo sundaraba. Riprokoto rika sundaraba. Let your will be done in this prayer group. Let your will be done. Let your will be done. Let your will be done. And let your kingdom come. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. As we are holding our hands together in one accord, we come against every power of darkness, working against the mission of this group that is working tirelessly to disintegrate this group, that is working tirelessly to bring this prayer group down. Father, in the name of Jesus, let the fire from the Eucharistic altar arise. Let the God of the Eucharist arise. Every evil conspiracy in the spiritual, in the physical, the Holy Ghost, 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 in the name of Jesus. Your word said that surely they shall gather. If the gathering is not of you, they shall scatter. Let every gathering against this prayer group, against your mission, your vision and will for this prayer group, let every gathering, oh Lord, be scattered by fire in the name of Jesus. Your word in Isaiah 54, 15, 15 says, if anyone attacks you, they do that without my consent. Therefore, they shall fall for your sake. As divine adorers, we stand in one accord. According to your word, I say whatever we agree here is agreed in heaven. Whatever we bound here is bound in heaven. We bind here is bound in heaven. So we decree, O oh Lord, that anyone rising against any divine adorer or our prayer group, that they fall for our sake in the name of Jesus. Let the fire, your own fire, from the Eucharistic altar, the highest altar, let this fire surround each and every divine adorer and every family represented here in the mighty name of Jesus. For those who are online, let this fire, O oh Lord, be also extended to them in the name of Jesus. Blessed Mother Mary, the one in place to be in our midst in a special way today, to intercede for us, our families, and our loved ones, wherever they may be, that the name of Jesus, our Son, is glorified and adored. As we pray, we fly unto your patronage, most holy Mother of God. Despise not our prayers and our necessities, but deliver us from all dangers. O oh, ever glorious and blessed Virgin Mary, amen. Please let us pray for Ugochuku as he travels back to school. Ugochuku, step forward. Commit him into the holy hands of God, that God will take care of him, even as he's in, in college. And pray for all other kids who are in college, whose families are here. Begin to pray for him, for Johnny Mercies. Pray for God's grace upon his life. Marebo sekerebo sundaraba. 
that he will know God, that he will serve God with his whole heart, that above all, his heart will be unto where the Lord is. In the name of Jesus, ask God to release his grace upon him, the spirit of excellency, wisdom and understanding. In the name of Jesus, Father, we consecrate him in one accord to the altar of the Eucharist, that he would never depart from your ways. In the name precious blood of Jesus. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. And amen. Praise God. Amen. So let's just be seated. Remember tomorrow we are going to visit Steve's um, son. Uh, please let us make sure we are there. Time is um, 3 p.m. We only there for two hours. If we come on time, we'll leave on time. Um, let us remember to always visit the Blessed Sacrament. Where is Father Joseph? See, we are waiting for the priest. Nobody should go. Jesus has not left. Jesus. Lord Jesus. Lord Jesus. Your people have enjoyed your company. And I know that you delight in their presence and receive their praise. As long as it comes with a humble, contrite, pure, grateful heart. It is a pleasing fragrance before you. I will hear the prayers of your people. Pour out your blessing. Tantu mego sacramento.
You have given them bread from heaven. Let us pray. Lord Jesus Christ, you gave us the Eucharist as the memorial of your suffering and death. May our worship of the sacrament of your body and blood help us to experience the salvation you won for us and the peace of the kingdom where you live with the Father and the Holy Spirit, God forever and ever. Blessed be God, blessed be his holy name, blessed be Jesus Christ, true God and true man, blessed be the name of Jesus, blessed be his most sacred heart, blessed be his most precious blood, blessed be Jesus and the most holy sacrament of the altar, blessed be the Holy Spirit, the paraclete. Blessed be the great Mother of God, Mary most holy. Blessed be her holy and immaculate conception. Blessed be her glorious assumption. Blessed be the name of Mary, Virgin and Mother. Blessed be Saint Joseph, her most chaste spouse. Blessed be God in his angels and in his saints. May the heart of Jesus in the most blessed sacrament be praised, adored, and loved with grateful affection at every moment in all the tabernacles of the world, even unto the end of time. Amen. Oh. 